BQ is back, baby. And when it comes to today's verdict, man, what a dump. Hit the music. We are live at Waste Management's Mid-Atlantic facility here in Tullytown, Pennsylvania. And we're here to look at all the gulls that congregate at this beautiful landfill. Everywhere we look, there are gulls. Herring gulls, blue gulls, great blackback gulls, lesser blackback gulls, Iceland gulls. Dreams do come true. Shorty, turn around. Look behind you. Gulls everywhere. It's amazing. It's like heaven. So many gulls that we are in the splash zone all day today, folks. There it is. Look at that. That's a Nelson's gull. It's a Glaucus and Herring gull hybrid right here. Holy smokes. A first for me. I haven't had a chance to get into the basics yet, and we're already finding the good stuff. Great bird. This is just so amazing. Down there, we've got great blackback gulls. We've got herring gulls. We've got ring-billed gulls, plus all these unusual things. Here with our boy Jared today. Say what's up, Jared. What's up? So tell me this, Jared. It's just another day at the office for you? Just another day at the office. Wow. Here at the landfills in uh, Tullytown, Pennsylvania. We do 20,000 tons a day of trash in these facilities. And as you can see, we attract many birds to that facility. Amazing. And visitors as well. So thank you all for coming and checking our birds out. Thank you for having us, Jared. First cycle Iceland gull right here. You can see completely pale bird, pink legs, black bill, and look at those white wing tips. Oh, baby. I love those white wing tips. Much more common, the largest gull in the world, the great blackback gull right there. Right next to that, a couple of herring gulls. This herring gull really going for it. Wow. I've been telling you about this for years. Is this place everything I said it was? Yeah, it's a lovely smell you've discovered too. Yeah. <laughs> Another Iceland gull here featuring those white wing tips right in the center of the frame. Just dropped my phone in the landfill here. Not good. What a hardy crew. Looking at all this magic. Here with George Armistead, author of Better Birding and The Birds of Pennsylvania, available at all fine major retailers and outlets and wherever books are sold. George, how do you feel about today? Pretty amazing spectacle out here. It must be, I don't know, eight, ten thousand gulls. We've got ice and gulls everywhere. Nice bunch of lesser blackback gulls. And uh, Nelson's gull was pretty cool too. Nice hybrid. Yeah. Maybe one or two other hybrids too. A bunch of great stuff. Amazing. On our way back to the vans to uh, go to our next location. Bad place to fall. You should be fine behind your van there. Yeah. Biohazard. That's good. Got to be careful while we're out here. Uh, these trucks are driving around and unloading this trash, and they're really not used to birders being around here uh, doing their thing. So, got to be careful. That's where we just came from. Come down here now to check out all the ones in this mound. Good call coming over here. We have another first year Iceland gull right here in the center. If you look at the very back, you can see those white wing tips. Only bird up there with white wing tips. We've seen a ton of Iceland gulls today, which they are quite the rarity, even though we've seen a ton of them. We're seeing so many because there's just so many gulls congregated here. New bird for the trip, first cycle Glaucus gull, all white bird with the pink legs. It's got a pink bill with a black tip, bicolored bill. Very similar to a first cycle Iceland gull. Glaucus gulls have that bicolored bill. Oh, man, they're typically that. more pure white and they're much larger. What a bully. I gotta say, Shorny, when it comes to birding here at the landfill, this is like the 80s hair metal of birding. Everything is about excess, especially in numbers. So many Iceland gulls here that we have two right next to each other, right in the center of the frame here. Holy smokes. Now that was a close call. Super cool comparison here. On the right, we have a lesser blackback gull. See the dark mantle and the yellow legs? On the left here, we have a herring and lesser blackback gull hybrid. If you look, it's got a mantle that's not as dark, actually between lesser blackback and herring coloration, and the leg coloration is more chalky, not yellow. Chad with gulls, that's what I call this one. It's a classic. 
two Iceland goals together here, even closer. What, George? I think we got some happy customers here, huh? One of the greatest inventions for a place like this. Boot cleaner. Six species of gulls today, two hybrid species of gull, both of which were first timers for me. George, how'd you feel about today? Pretty amazing, man. That's, there was a ton of gulls, great variety, some rare things, some really cool hybrids. Um, huge, big glaucous gull, awesome day. Awesome. Well, thanks to Jared and thanks to our friends at Waste Management for having us today. Stay fresh and peace out, y'all.